Hey, what up, Z Clan and everybody else? How you doing? I hope you're doing good. Welcome to my Fallout 76 video. So, in this notification video, we'll cover the Atomic Shop, see the new free items, two of them that are coming here, uh, and they're related to the QuakeCon event. Uh, afterwards, we're also going to take a look at the daily challenges and see what we got to do in order to make some scores. So, let's stop wasting time and jump right into it. Alright, so let's navigate to the Atomic Shop and check out those free outfits, eh? Alright, so everything else I already covered uh, back on the Tuesday video and we haven't had anything coming new since then. But we do have this Billy Billy head <laughs> right here. Included in QuakeCon 2020 promotion. So it's a free one. Let's go. And this backpack here. What up? <laughs> Alright, so four days left in order to get these things. Uh, Alright, so once you've claimed them, what you'll need to do is navigate to your workbench. That's for in case if you're new and you don't know how to do it. You navigate to your outfits and then you find the outfit uh, that you was looking for. Oh wait, uh, I think it's on the very top, no? Yeah, there we go. That's the suit. Then, because there's a head involved as well, we need to go to the head section. That's the head. And for the backpack, we need to change uh, the workshop and na navigate to our backpack here. And change the actual skin. There we go. Mr. Demonic Backpack. <laughs> Alright, so that already uh, got included onto the backpack as you can see right here. Yo, actually this backpack looks cool with my samurai outfit. <laughs> I love it. Now, let's navigate to the apparel section. And you're going to bet news Billy. By the way, for those who do not know, there are a couple of versions of this outfit. One of the outfits you can earn by doing the sheep squatch event. Uh, another version is a black one, a fully black one, and it's part of the Atomic Shop, so it comes back time to time. Unfortunately, it's nighttime right now, and I can't show in more details, but it actually looks good. Uh, I like the red thingies with them and all. You know what? You can you know, sort of make a ninja out of this outfit. If you remove the helmet, oh. boom! Ah, oh, that thing just messes up everything. Why you had to, man? I was thinking all I have to do is just find some good other helmet and stuff like that, and I'll get myself a good looking. Oh well. Well, we're gonna go with the samurai outfit back again. Do do. Eh to find a part the shredder style <laughs> alright so that's about it for the atomic shop when it is new and let's navigate to the challenges and see what we gotta do so for the daily buy an item from another or sell an item from another player complete an event while in a group uh, scrap or craft or scrap a piece of power armor uh, drink nuka cola thank god I got those on me man by the way, uh, I'll walk you through how to do them in a, in a bit. Gold stars complete five of the dailies and will trigger automatically. Kill a glowing creature, kill a, a mole miner, and level up, obviously. And in nuclear winter, you use stim pack three times, which I ain't doing. Alright, so if you're a veteran, you definitely know how to do all these th all these things. Now, let me kind of like explain how you can do this. So, buy or sell an item from another player. You can do that in the public world. Just go to any vending machine. Uh, buy, let's say, for example, a bullet three times. So, you got to go bullet, 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 buy, 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 transaction, transaction, transaction. <laughs> so, you got to complete three transactions and you will trigger this 
the 250 score. Complete an event while in a group, well that's super easy now that we have the public teams it's even easier. Well first of all you can join any public team or you can create your own and by the way you don't really need anybody anybody to be on your team to do that event you can do the solo even as long as you have the public event team active I already tested it it works and it worked a couple of days ago when I tested it so if we never get back uh, craft or scrap power armor pieces you can either go if you don't want to waste your resources you can just go and find power armors uh, on top of my head where I remember there's definitely a power armor Eastern Regional Penitentiary uh, it's right next to the uh, gym yard, whatever, where, where the uh, prisoners, you know, grow those guns, <laughs> work out. Uh, then there's one more, and it's not always, but it's a chance it's going to be there. A power plant and a Mononga power plant, uh, a thing, oh no, wait. Oh yeah, it is, this one, but inside, and you'll need to hack a terminal to get it. Then there is one in at Octus Pharma, not inside, but like sort of inside the building, but not inside the actual where you do the uh, Project Paradise event. So, kind of like in that area on the third or second floor, can't remember. Now, there is also power armor sometimes at the Johnson's Arc uh, on the very top of the cliff. You gotta go there. There is also one. I believe at the Graham Mining Headquarters. That's where, by the way, you trigger the event which teaches you how to craft the excavator power armor. And I think level 25 is required for that one. Not not sure. So you can visit those locations, get it, or uh, just go to your uh, station over here. But you will need to drop your power armor in order to craft. So let me see if I have one. No, I don't have one on me. And my stash. So basically, you drop your uh, power arm body, craft, scrap, done. <laughs> you gotta do it three. So you can uh, craft two things and scrap two things. And you will already overdo, but you know. Uh, challenges drink Nuka Cola. There is a lot of Nuka Cola in this location right here. A Nuka Cola plant, and there's a lot of it over there. What I can do, I can just go to my pit boy right here and find some cola, cola. There we go. Nuka cherry, Nuka cola. Bam, bam, bam. Done. So that was pretty simple for me because I always have those things on me. So then kill a glowing creature and a mole miner. I would highly recommend to collab these two. Uh, once you see a uh, uranium fever, so uranium fever starts over here at the Blackwater mine. Over there, they are glowing. There's a lot of high level players. I'm speaking from a low level perspective. Uh, so, uh, your job is to shoot the glowing thing. Don't kill it. Don't f don't try to kill it. As, as long as you shot it and somebody else will kill it, you'll still get uh, the kill count plus you kill mole miners. Uh, for lower levels, also, I think think well that's what I'm gonna be doing the best place is Welch that's where kinda like under level 50 guys are there <laughs> uh, so yeah you go that location over there also you can find a whole bunch of them in this area map but I would say somewhere in this region but specifically in Welch there's a whole bunch of them and I believe that is it ah glowing creature so in case if you did not find a uh, the uranium fever etc uh, then maybe give it a try over here manhunt by the way I'm gonna do that right now and we'll complete something uh, the reason why is that um, there is always super mutants over there and those super mutants something have those hounds or, or super mutant dog and well if you're kinda like well sometimes it's glowing for me it pretty much always uh, the glowing type one and by the way this manhand uh, event I definitely recommend you doing because once again it's always super mutants and actually it gives a lot of uh, cap rewards and obviously we got to do it for the daily challenge <laughs> so okay this thing finally loaded in one of those really long I was about to pause myself but since we're here why not do it 
So here are the super mutants. Let's see if we're gonna be lucky. See level 10. No, not lucky. So that dog I was talking about, since most probably this is a low level area, that's why uh, it's a not glowing type. Okay, then I have, well, the best place West Egg then, I believe. West Egg. Oh, come on, man. I was trying to do a video here, stupid mutant. This location where I'm at sometimes spawns a glowing creature. That's uh, the lowest level I remember. And the location is in this area. Sometimes you can find a ghoul, sometimes you can find Snalagaster, but I believe it's also scaled to your level. Uh, honestly, I do not know where for the new players you can get another glowing, like, you know, easy. Look at this lag, man. Oh my god. Alright, and this is where I'm going to be calling it the end for this video. So I hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, don't forget to hit that like, comment down below. Please make sure not to use profanity as those comments get triggered by YouTube. Nobody see them. I see them, I read them, and I delete them. So if you got something negative to say, you can always say it without swearing the living hell out of my comments. If you do, well, the comment get deleted. Do it often, get banned. Simple as that. Uh, if you're new and you subscribe, welcome to Z Clan. I'm Gamer Z Soul from Ukraine. So hi from Ukraine. Our clan has grown to 5,761 Z Clan members. We do have an active Discord channel, uh, over 500 members over there. And if you want to join us, feel free to do so. The link is down in video description. But read the rules, because if you're not gonna follow the rules, you will get banned. In short, family friendly. If you don't get it? Read the rules. Uh, also, I created a tutorial for Discord because I know uh, some of you do not know what Discord is and how to use it. So I created uh, a tutorial on how you can get started, how to get the roles so you see the correct chats, and everything in that area. So you might want to check it out. The link is also down in the video description. So, guys, thanks all for watching. I hope you enjoyed the show. And if you did, you know the drill. Don't forget to hit that like. I'll see you all next time. You all have a good morning, day, and night. And by the way, we play not only 76, other games are also For Honor, Warzone, and other stuff. So check out our Discord. I'm pretty sure you're going to be well surprised. Bye. From the ashes we rose into the future we'll go. We are the